So does everybody like this show called Big Bang Theory? It's exciting and it's funny and it's full of science. Science? Sorry. Hilo. Hilo. Hello, everybody. Hi, everybody. Hilo, everybody. Welcome back to DDM, the answers for 229. It was part of the theme song for the Big Bang Theory, very popular show. If you didn't do the dictation, you've got to click on these links or go down into the description and you can find the links there. Try it. It's not easy. And if you've done it, let's go over the answers. We built a wall, we built the pyramids, math, science, history, unraveling the mystery that all started with the Big Bang Bang! Too easy? Can you sing it? Can you sing it with me? Okay, I'm not going to sing anymore. Let's go over the words. We built a, we built a wall. Some people, many people wrote the, we built the, the T connects. It almost sounds like a D. We built a wall, we built a wall, we built a wall. Which wall is he talking about? I'm sure he's talking about the Great Wall of China. Everybody knows about the Great Wall of China, right? But we're not sure because he says a wall, but I'm sure he means the one in China. We built the pyramids. We built the... And here the T and the TH go together. We built the pyramids. So. The Chinese people built the wall. The Egyptians built the pyramids, right? Well, who is we? We means mankind, humans, all of us. But yes, we know this is China pride and this is Egypt pride, but we are the same family. I hope you think so. We are, genetically. It's true. Anyway. We built a wall, we built a wall, we built a wall. We built the pyramids, we built the pyramids. Everybody knows the pyramids, the famous pyramids in Giza, very close to Cairo, right outside Cairo. If you go to Google Maps, you can see both the Great Wall of China and the pyramids. Fantastic. Math, science, history. Math, science, history. A lot of people got this. Now, what's interesting, in the UK, they say maths with an S. But in America, we don't include an S. It's just math. So the guys that are singing, they're American. So without a doubt, they're saying math. Math, science, history. This S is strong, so it's H is kind of tough to hear, but most people got it. Math, science, history. Math, science, history. Unraveling the mystery. Whoops, that was bad. Unraveling. Ah, this is tough pronunciation. R, V, L. Very difficult for many students. Unraveling, 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 unraveling the... And the faster we say this, the NG can cancel the TH and it sounds like na. Unraveling na, unraveling the... Perfect pronunciation. Unraveling the, unraveling the... Unraveling the mystery. So here we have history rhyming with mystery. Several people put an S, mysteries. That's wrong. But there are many sites on the internet that put the lyrics as mysteries. That's wrong. It's mystery. Listen again. Unraveling the mystery that started. Oops. That all started with a big bang, bang. There we go. That all, that all, 
that all, just like here, built, uh, built, uh, built, uh, that all, that all. So this connects. This is an AW sound. We don't say all, all. We say all, all, that all, that all. Not easy. That all started with the, started with the, and it's with a, with a meaning one, a single, a single event. With the big bang, bang! And everybody knows about the big bang theory, the expanding universe. Some scientists aren't sure about the big bang theory. They're not sure about evolution. But I'm sure we have all he heard about the theory. And remember, when we say the word theory, it's not fact. It's not proof. It has a good chance of being true, but it hasn't been proven yet. Anyway, this is the a part of the opening song to the very popular situation comedy called The Big Bang Theory. We built a wall, we built the pyramids, mass science history unraveling the mystery that all started with the Big Bang Bang! <clears throat> yeah. Uh, unraveling the mystery. Oh, this is a great expression. What does it mean to unravel something? Well, if something is rolled up, for example, I have a piece of paper here, and I wonder, ooh, what is in this document? Oh, I really wonder. So I am unraveling, unraveling this amazing document, which has my schedule. My schedule is really bad. I'm falling behind. I should not have unraveled this. Let me ravel it back up. There. It looks better like this. Bye-bye. So here we are unraveling the mystery. Oh, the mystery. We're figuring out slowly, slowly, slowly the mystery. Unraveling the mystery. Uh, that, we can say which, which all started with, which all began with a big bang. And that's pretty much it. Actually, it's easy. But it's really difficult to hear. I agree. Many students like to study English with pop songs. That's great. I encourage that. But remember, the pronunciation is going to be really difficult. It's going to be tough. However, if you listen to pop songs and you practice singing along with the song, it really does help your daily English pronunciation. Sometimes words are pronounced a little bit strangely, but anyway, overall, I do encourage my students, you guys, to listen to pop songs if you like pop songs. It can be like The Beatles, or The Bare Naked Ladies, or Guns N' Roses, or Aerosmith. What about Eminem? and Tupac Shakur. Well, sure. Uh, it's fun, and uh, I don't think Eminem and Eminem has very useful English. Well, maybe, maybe. But anyway, I do encourage you guys to listen to pop songs. When I started studying Korean, I studied Korean pop songs or Korean songs back in the 1980s and I would listen to them and I would repeat. I had no idea what the songs meant but I would sing along with the songs and it really helped my pronunciation. So I can still sing Korean songs and Korean people will say, wow that's really good and I'm like, thank you. but. I don't know what I said. <laughs> However, my pronunciation is good. And it's very important that you guys master your pronunciation. So let's say this.
three times together, we'll go slowly, then a little bit faster, and then normal speed. Okay? Here we go. We built a wall. We built the pyramids. Math, science, history, unraveling the mystery that all started with a big bang. Bang! We built a wall, we built the pyramids. Math, science, history, unraveling the mystery that all started with a big bang. Bang! I'm sorry, that is terrible. One more time. <clears throat> we built a wall, we built the pyramids. Math, science, history, unraveling the mystery that all started with a big bang. Bang! My apologies to your ears. I know I am not the best singer, but I tried a little bit. The Bare Naked Ladies are much better. That's it for DD229. DD230 is coming up. I think it will be a bit easier. Do your best, and I'll see you next time. And don't forget, if you can, now DD, Daily Dictation is great. They're light lessons, not too deep. But if you really want to invest in your English, I think you should try DDM, Daily Dictation Members, Daily Dictation Masters. Uh, it's a fun class and we just started April. We start actually April 2nd, so if you want to begin in April, there is still time to join for April. Okay? Thank you very much and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye!